Hi, my name's Johnny and I play Tony. I'm Lucia Mastrantoni and I'm playing the role of Angela Moretti. I think Dead Cat Bounce is about love, what we do for love, the compromises we make for love, uh, the lies we tell ourselves. We all tell ourselves, or we have told ourselves little lies. We've told our partners little lies. It's, a, it's, it's more obviously about addiction, um, but not only about physical addiction, being addicted to the drama of relationships, being addicted to a person, um, and I guess they are physical. They do manifest in physical ways. There's four characters in it, and um, I just held up three things. <laughs> there's four characters in it, um, and there, so there's you know the the person that has the addiction, the, the 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 alcoholic addiction, the new lover that is trying to save him, his ex lover who is over saving him, and the ex lover's new partner and he is trying to stop um, uh, Angela, my character, who is the ex-lover, from continuously wanting to sort of get something from Gabriel who is unable to give it to me. Tony's biggest want is for Angela to give herself to him wholeheartedly and to let go of her past love Gabriel. He, he can see that she's still attached and he wants her to sever that and he never stops not wanting that. We've all played one of those people, if not all of them. We've all played either the addict or the helper of the addict or the ex-helper or... So we've, it's really interesting because you really feel the audience can relate and a lot of people feel so moved at the end of it because um, we know it so well. We know what love is and we know what addiction is and we know what both of them are together. I would like people to come away with a feeling of hopefulness in this play. Um, it's, there's some bleak moments in this play and there's a lot of gnarliness and heartache and drama but I think it's hopeful. There's, there's hope. And Mary Rachel Brown, the extraordinary writer, I worked with her and we worked it out 20 years to the day in Griffin in a play that I directed, one of the first plays I directed and Mary um, wrote. Um, it was a, a mad kind of comedy and it was almost like 20 years down the track that we reignited this relationship, this work relationship, and I've been wanting to work with Mary forever. So the cast and the creatives are, were a big part of the, um, the, the reason I wanted to do it, and working for Griffin. <laughs>